Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Clay and in today's video, we're going to be checking out the ranked play MCW in Modern Warfare 3. If you're new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and also like the video. Let's try to get 35 likes on today's video. I'd highly appreciate it and it helps out the channel a bunch. Now, the reason why I say the ranked play MCW is because this is the main class setup that everybody is using in ranked play. And I decided to bring it over into pubs and it absolutely fries. If you don't believe me, I highly recommend watching the gameplays I have for you guys. I have a MGBN1 and just a regular, like, you know, high kill gameplay in the second. Now let's quickly jump straight into the class setup for the MCW. Starting us off on a more personal preference attachment. I like the Slate Reflector. That is uh, what a lot of people use in rank play. And uh, people also use the MK3 Reflector. I was a big fan of the Slate Reflector, at, like, near the beginning of the game. But I have grown to really, really enjoy the MK3 Reflector. I've also seen people using I can't remember. I think it's I think it's this one. It kind of gives you a little bit of no uh like visual recoil, but you do lose aim down sight speed while using this optic. So like it's really up to you if you want to use this or it's pubs so you can literally go with like any uh, uh optic that you want. If you wanted to, you could put a, a 2.5 magnification on your MCW. That's all up to you. That is why it's a personal preference attachment. Now jumping into the rear grip, we're going to be using the RB Claw PSL grip. This gives you firing aim stability, gun kick control, and recoil control. The cons are aiming out of sway. Now I, I've also seen a lot of people change this around. I don't have all of them unlocked because I am on a relatively new account. But I like to use the DR6 hand stop for the underbarrel. It gives you aim walking speed, aim down side speed, sprint to fire speed, and movement speed. And if you've been watching my videos for a while, you do know that I love movement speed. I love just being able to get around the map as quick as I can. And on the muzzle, we're gonna be going with the L4R flash hider muzzle. This gives you muzzle flash concealment, recoil control, and gun kick control. This is another attachment that I have seen people change. People do like to use the, um, it's called the, the billeted break. I can't, I don't know if I'll be able to find it. Okay, here it is. It's the T51R billeted break. This does take away horizontal recoil and bullet velocity and range. So I do not recommend going with that one unless you struggle with like controlling recoil. And over on the barrel, this is the barrel that nobody changes unless you are like, I don't know, you just... I absolutely don't like using this one. It's the 16.5 inch MCW Cyclone Long Barrel. This gives you bullet velocity and range, aiming out of sway, and firing aim stability. You do lose out on hip fire intact stand spread, but in rank play, people don't really care about that. And it, the only reason why you should care about that is if you're going for the challenges. And I don't even know if the MCW has that challenge. It also takes away aim walking speed and sprint to fire speed, but it's fine in the end. That is going to do it for my MCW class setup. This is the rest of my class setup. I've heard that people don't really like it whenever I go over it, so I'm trying to limit that as much as possible. But like I said in the beginning of the intro, I have two gameplays for you guys. One is MGB, and the second gameplay, I choked the MGB. I was just playing a little dumb. But I hope you guys enjoy those, and as always, if you do, let me know with a like, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace. A small percentage of people that watch my videos are subscribed. So if you like this video, consider subscribing and also follow me on Twitch where I stream and play with followers. Also, if you'd like to, you can follow me on Twitter where you can stay up to date with me. And I also have a Discord. So if you'd like to, we can connect more on there. Now let's get back to the video. All right, we're going to be checking out the MCW today. My game has been acting a little weird and I've been getting into some demon lobbies ever since I started playing again. I, I honestly don't know what to do. This, this lobby seems relatively easier, but it's it looks dead. There's two people just not playing. I knew he was going to be behind me. All right, we're on a seven here. Call that UAV in.
I'm out of ammo on my MCW, so this is gonna be a. This is gonna be pretty hard. Oh, I got ammo now. Why are they still spawning back here? Gotta keep your ammo in. Almost got no scoped. They're gonna be spawning back here. Gotta play this very smart. Nice UAV. They're still spawning back there too, so... Right here. I don't know where this guy went. I'm scared. My teammate's following me. That guy has a sniper. It's an easy kill. That's uh that's called a VTOL in. There's a nuke right there, baby. First, I, I, I was going to say first game on, but I would have been lying. Definitely not the first game on. I've had like five test, test games that just didn't go good. We're on a little streak though. We got to keep this going. I'll probably have another game too because this one it's only been five minutes and this game's almost over nice that finally got us off the streak Throw a trophy here for our teammate and push up. No, he was right behind us. I feel like I'm sitting weird in my chair. You ever like feel like something's off in your like your setup or something and you just you just can't play regular god that guy is jump shotting like crazy might actually be able to extend this game Gotta be careful not call that MGB in. They're gonna be spawning back here. That 
That's gonna be game. Seen him. My teammates are gonna end it here. Let's go. Fifty nine kills. I have another gameplay for you guys. GG's. I thought it would be like a good idea to go ahead and put like the second map on Mercado for the MCW. I think it's actually a really good gun for this map. It's it's not like too close quarters. Like you could still fry with the MCW like. They're still spawning over here. See if anybody chows me over here. Teammates got a UAV that is nice. Oh my god. If I didn't see that green laser, I was dead. Might be a guy coming over here. I'm actually frying right now. This might be the first, the first gameplay. I'm holding that angle way too long. Maybe not long enough. I see feet right there. I think that ride show guy is gonna come up here. He's waiting for me. Oh my god, he could have killed me easily. Okay, that guy's coming up here. He jumped down. Alright, we need to move. No, my teammate could have killed him right there. Oh my god. Okay, we need to we need to win this game. Actually, I might get reported after this game. I'm frying. No, die. No. All right, come on. Come on, teammates, come over here. I don't want to completely give this up because somebody might have ghosts. Teammate, don't push the door. I could have dropped a nuke. Oh my god. I still can't believe I died right there. And I pushed out and died to a holger. It's still a very, very good game for for second gameplay. Dang, 
I am actually getting fried on... I just got stuck. God. Pringle Slayer. Okay. <clears throat> there was a guy right there or whatever. We'll leave him. This camera is so clean. Well, 57 kills, GG's. Dead.